Okay, can we try one more time the, the, the very beginning? A little bit late, horns. So what we've done so far was we've spent a week with uh, observing the London Philharmonic mainly, and we had one session with them uh, a couple of months ago, and now we're all back in London for March to spend the bulk of the week with the Philharmonia this time. And this includes uh, two sessions, one which we're about to have in about one hour with uh, Gustavo Dudamel working on Mahler's Fifth Symphony. Uh, our next session is on Sunday and that's uh, with Esa Pekka Salonen. Where are we leading to as a concert in March at the Royal Festival Hall with the Philharmonia Orchestra? Well today has been exciting because the whole day almost has been about Mahler Fifth. And we have followed the rehearsals since the morning and uh, seen how he works on that piece. Give a little bit more in bar three. But a little. It's only about the intensity, not about the dynamic, because if not, we'll be forte. Okay. Uh, four with levare. With pickup. And one. For me this evening is sort of about three things, three very exciting things. First of all, we're getting conduct Mahler. Secondly, we're doing it for the first time, or working for the first time with one of the world's great orchestras, the Philharmonia. Thirdly, the fact that we've got uh, someone as brilliant and inspirational as Gustavo Dudamel looking over our shoulders makes this evening um, rather <laughs> special. I think daunting is the word, perhaps terrifying. Good. Okay. They are they are still playing. Sure, okay. If, <laughs> if you have to give two girlfriends, you have to take care of all. <laughs> okay. Okay, no only one. <clears throat> six directly. I think right. that makes you both my girlfriends. <laughs> but that's okay with you guys. Right on six, please. heartbeat goes like it's it's really crazy it's a crazy moment because if you are able to deal with that kind of pressure with uh, with that situation you learn so much that was better it's better in one oh. Bef before before they go to rest Try number two one time. Only this place of number two. And then look at this very important thing. When you start from here, this is very cantabile. It's a lot of it's movement. Okay. Look, 
because this forte, you, you have to feel the cellist that they play. La Re, this, this fifth. Okay. And don't have to be hippie. Have the control, because when you are in two, the music, the music. Can I go please once more from the beginning? It was wonderful. It was kind of hard to get um, into the material, as you probably see, but as soon as you feel kind of comfortable with what is going on, it's just amazing. He's such a positive person and it feels like the way he conducts, he's also like a human being. Very, ener very much energy and very positive and encouraging, of course. It's a lot of beautiful things that you can... Our instrument is not the baton. This is yeah. not true. Yeah. Our instrument is all our body. You can jump, you can move, you can dance, you can do whatever. And always the orchestra will follow. If you do like this, they will play staccato. <laughs> or if you do like this, it's, it's legato. Last time, last time. Yeah, great. Last time, sorry. Great. Same place. Comfortable feeling that you have the, all the sound in your hands. Here, the left is important. Here. Good. Give the crescendo to violas and celli. Now, the crescendo there. Yes. Yes. Perfect. Because you, uh, yeah. this was a lot of things here, 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 but you have to turn. Okay, let's try number letters, uh, number seven. Oh, it was very, <laughs> very exciting. Uh, I enjoyed it. Uh, it's a great thing to do for the first time. I certainly feel very happy having had a test run with a with a Rolls Royce orchestra on on music like this. <laughs> If we learn anything here, it's probably that we have so much to learn. <laughs> I was part of this academy and, and this was something really very important for, no, no for my career, for my life. <laughs>